my man! How are you? We finished it today, man! We finished your cafe! The thing that this building once was an old rotten empty piece of garbage isn't easy when you look at this place now, huh? Although, we are not 100% done yet. We're planning to do some nifty stuff up in the attic, but we haven't decided exactly what yet, so that room still has its old state. Uh, there's also a little window up in the attic, and behind that window is just a small room, we just use that for machinery stuff. But we still have one more week to work before the cafe opens to the public, so we've got plenty of time. Though. I have yet to understand why you would want to be here during the night. With all these thieves nowadays, especially since everything here is new, it can be quite dangerous. So we took this into consideration and gave you one of these fancy new computers with security cameras connected to it. Pretty fancy, huh? Now you can have a full overview of the whole place. Now you'll probably find yourself bored eventually staring at the computer screen and stuff, so I suggest you take a little tour around the building tonight. You know, getting to know the place, the room locations and other stuff like that. And one final note, the power here isn't easy to handle. The power might shut down now and then because the generator stops and runs out of energy. Now listen to me, the generator is located in the far right corner of the basement, got it? You can reset it at any time by just clicking on the big button on it. If you do this often enough, it shouldn't be a problem at all. Although, if it does run out, no worries, just reset it again and the power should be back shortly. Enjoy your new place, man, and have a fun night.
Wario, my good man! Do you hear me clearly? I sure hope so, man. You weren't at work today, so... I just had to call you to tell you this, cause something crazy went down today. So, I had lunch break, relaxing and goofing around with the camera system, you know, and I saw you! You, with wide glowing eyes and a deformed face! You were just standing there by the back door, so I naturally went to check if it was you, but no! You were nowhere to be seen when I got there! No one else there believed me, but that looked like a freaking demon to me, man! It almost looked non-physical! I could clearly see that it was something evil though, so I got out of there! But if you wanna stay, fine! Be crazy! Although, I would suggest that if you see this thing on the camera like I did, do not go into the same room as it, okay? Who knows what will happen when you're on your own with it. That story aside, uh, we've put lots of invisibility mushrooms in the storage today. And if I were you, I'd go there and grab one of those mushroom if that thing started to get close to my room. Bring it back to the main room and eat it. Alright, it will turn you invisible for a short while, but be careful. If you keep it for too long, it will spoil. And you'll be forced to take it back to the bathroom and wash it for it to be usable again. Also, try not to be away from the main room you're in for too long, okay? I think you're a whole lot safer in there. I tell you, man, I've got no freaking idea what's going on, but you stay if you want.
I don't think I'll ever understand why you still want to do this. I mean, are you alright? Were you dropped on your head back when you were a little baby or something? <laughs> By the way, I'm sorry for blaming you yesterday. I wasn't aware that he only worked at night this first week, so, um... Anyway, I didn't chicken out. I came back to work today, and all of us forgot to reset the generator, so... The power got itself a hard time, but I did go back, I turned it on, and guess what? I checked the camera when I got back and something was standing up in the attic. I didn't see it when I passed the room on my way back, but it was clearly there on the camera. It was just standing in the machinery room behind the attic, in the window, looking down at me. Like, it seemed to appear as the lights got cut off. I just had this feeling that it would eventually stand more and more up and stare straight at the camera if I left the power out for longer. I'd say be extra careful with the power tonight, pal. Keep resetting it as often as you can, and if it runs out, turn it on as quickly as you can and avoid the attic until you know if the creature in there is staring at you or not. Just like I saw you yesterday. I only saw this thing on the camera, not when I actually went to the room itself. I know all of this sounds a bit creepy, doesn't it? Oh, and one more thing. We've gotten some problems with the camera power too. Yeah, you cannot keep resetting that like the main generator. It's just too hot to touch. If the computer shuts down, head for the office and press the red glowing button to turn it on again. You got all that? I sure hope so, pal, cause you're gonna need that info. <laughs> you're crazy, man. You're just straight up crazy.
I have finally some good news for you, Wario! We have fixed the resetting generator! Kind of. You see, this generator would drain the power in the whole building, including the computer. Well, we managed to fix that today, but with that, a new problem appeared, obviously. We got a big problem with the lights in the building, Wario. They would shut off and it would be almost impossible to get them back on. If they run out tonight, all you can do is grab your trusty flashlight and use that. But flashlights don't live forever, obviously, so the batteries are the key here. Surprisingly, there are two locations you can grab these bad boys. The first one is in the same cabinet as you get the mushrooms. The other one, for some reason, is in the bathroom. Not sure if you have seen it, but lately there has been batteries just floating in front of the mirror in there. It is a lot shorter to the bathroom than to the storage, so while I have no freaking idea what the heck is going on here, we shouldn't say no to free batteries. I was planning to call some ghost capturing guys here, but this isn't any normal form of hunting, I believe.
Good evening, Wario. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, man. It's starting to get a little bit creepy in here, right? I mean, with the windy weather and the cloudy sky tonight, I've got some good and bad news for you, dude. Good news is, we've removed some boxes and other stuff in that machinery room behind the attic, so now you can look in that window to see on the other side. Not much to see in there, but one machine is connected to the camera power in the office, so... You can see the power drain in to give you a little insight of how much camera power you have left. Bad news... Though, well, the power ain't back. I hope you didn't throw away your flashlight, eh? But hold on, cause there are more bad news in store for you. Um, avoid the basement at all cost, because I saw someone or something in the basement on the camera. And when I got back to it later, I swear it I'd come closer. Whenever you have time, check on the basement camera, alright? Maybe looking at it often will keep whatever is down there in check. Anyways, next week is a big week. So promise me to be careful tonight, Wario. We need you.
great. Well, um, welcome to New Warriors. Give me some job.
Hello? Hello, hello? Are you there? Hey, look at that! I found your number! Alright, now, listen up. I really do appreciate you taking time out of your day to do this. But dude, this will turn out amazing! Maybe you are confused as to why we're reopening this old diner. The whole Warriors brand has some story to it, alright? The original owner supposedly died in his own factory back in the day. Can you believe that? Then people reopened it years later. And weird stuff started happening there, I'm telling you. A man named McCroy, who I think worked at the factory, went mad, and he was killed in the open streets not too long ago. After that, the rumored paranormal stuff that happened just seemed to stop. Sick stuff, for sure. But you've watched the news, just like me. It was after this that people started disappearing one by one. Of course this creates panic among people, so we're gonna act like, you know, the sun shining through the clouds in these dark times. Someone found the original secret recipe for the famous hamburger that the original owners used, so we kinda snatched it. <laughs> so people are going to sue get that original Wario's experience from back in the day. Now. There are a few things you got to do today, alright? The technology over there is like super old school. It hasn't been used since the late 80s, man. I think there are like security cameras all around the building and stuff with a monitor in every room too. I think only one of them works though. So you just gotta check on things. Give stuff a little test and see that everything works. It'll probably only take half an hour. If everything works, we should be ready to open soon. Again, sorry for asking you to do this in the middle of the day, but it will be worth it. Okay, dude, talk to you next week, okay?
Thank <laughs> you. 